So you've been trying to figure out how to create vertical text in Carbide Create. Where's the tool? Where's the function? Where's the button, right? Well, in Carbide Create, you can't do that. There is no tool as of yet. So in this video, I'm gonna share with you how I would go about creating that vertical text. So you're gonna wanna stick around if you're trying to figure this out. Hey, what's going on guys? This is Edgar with AE Timber and Pine. And I'm sure that there are multiple ways to create vertical text in Carbide Create. So the way that I'm gonna show you is probably just one of many ways but it's just the way that I think it's most easiest for me is just the way that my brain functions, how I am able to keep everything organized. If you are getting value out of the channel and liking this video, make sure to like and subscribe. It just helps get this information out to more viewers who are also looking for this type of information. So I would appreciate that. And without further ado, guys, let's just go ahead and jump into this quick video. Jump into Carbide Create, guys. This example is going to be a welcome sign and it's going to be seven by 24, seven inches wide and 24 inches tall. And I'm just gonna show you real quick how I would go about creating vertical text. When you create text, let's go ahead and just type in the word welcome. In Carbide Create, it's very easy to create the text in a horizontal direction, but there's no way of getting these letters to go vertically. You can rotate it, but it's not going to be in the correct orientation. It's just not possible in Carbide Create. There are probably different methods on how to do this or achieve this, but I just wanna show you the method that I would go with. And this is a way to guarantee that you'll have even spacing and even letter size all throughout the sign. Let's just go ahead and go into this example. In the word welcome, there are seven letters. So I need to divide those seven letters evenly within this space. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to divide 24 inches by seven, 24 inch height by seven letters. So this is going to be seven inches wide by 3.4285, just like that. Since there are seven letters in the word welcome, I need to create seven boxes and I'm going to align them within the actual sign, just like this. So now the sign is divided equally. Now I'm going to create the text. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna click on this create text option. I'm going to enter the letter W, click done. I'm then going to resize it And with the letter selected, I'm going to hold shift, select the first box, and I'm going to align it horizontally and vertically, just like that. So if I'm happy with this, I'm just going to go ahead and copy this letter and I'm going to paste it. And now I'm going to double click on it and change it to the letter E. By copying the letter W and editing the letter W, I'm going to ensure that the size of the letter is the exact same. So now I'm not having to worry about whether or not my letters are going to be the same size, I'm just, going, I'm just going to be using this method to keep it all the same. So with the letter selected, hold shift and click the next box and we're going to align horizontally and vertically. So I'm going to repeat this exact same process for all the letters. Now with all the letters completed and everything's aligned and centered, I can now go in and delete each of these individual boxes, just like this. And so that is the process that I would go through to create vertical text that is evenly spaced all throughout. I hope you guys enjoyed it and I'll see you guys on the next video.